What's up, guys? I haven't talked to you guys in a while. Uh, Irad and I, we, uh, we're at Gander right now, and we're going to go inside. We got a trip coming up soon. We're going to Gulf Shores, Alabama, but on the way, we're stopping at Guntersville Lake in Kentucky, and uh, I need some fishing supplies. So we're at Gander, and I'm going to go in there and bring you guys with and try to find some gear. See you in there. All right, first thing I'm looking for is a, a new rod. I'm gonna buy a casting rod. And uh, right here, we got the favor rods. I really like the bunkers ones. This one right here, in the back, it's gonna look like this. See that? Yeah, I, I like it. It's like seven foot two, medium heavy, fast action. I think that's what I'm gonna get. I think this one right here. Right there, guys. It costs one thirty, pretty much one twenty nine ninety nine. That would focus. And uh, yeah, now I gotta find a reel. Next thing I'm looking at, guys, is a reel. I'm trying to decide if I want this Sitica or if I want this Canon by Shimano. I've wanted a Shimano reel for a while just because they're pretty dope. Just look at them. Just look at them. They're sick. I think I'm going to get the Canon, see if I have it in a left-handed reeling over here. I think this is the winner right here, guys. Shimano Canon 151. Uh, just got a 631 gear ratio. That should be pretty good. Um, see what else she's got. I can fit about 120 uh, yards of 10 pound monofilament on here. So that'll be pretty good. And then I'll be matching it up with this rod right here. That's pretty sick. Pretty uh, pretty expensive combo, but yeah, that happens. Hey guys, was checking out this clearance section and found some 50 pound braid for the summer. Throw on some jig rods for six bucks. Always gotta check out the clearance That's section. That's a deal and a half, buddy. Look at all this stuff. Really cheap prices too. Yo, they even have Guggen baits here. We got the trench hog. We got all sorts of stuff. Even got the Kraken Craw. That's insane. Might have to look through here, see what we got. Oh, they even got the Slim Shakes. That's just dope. Well, maybe I'll see what my price is at right now and see if I can buy some Guggen baits. It's pretty sick. Yo, we got the goods, we got the goods. It's kind of windy out here. Spent a, spent a nice nice sized penny on this stuff, but uh, it's gonna be well worth it. We're all checked out, guys. Uh, we got the rod in the car, it's all the way up in the front, you know, in a little car. Uh, A-Rod bought some line, right, Rod? N yeah. Nice yawn, huh? Yeah, tired. <laughs> yeah, well, that was pretty fun. When we get home, I'll have to show you guys uh, what I bought, unbox it. I also bought another rod last week, a uh, cheaper rod. And I'll show you guys that one too, but from now we're signing off. See ya. See ya. Well guys, uh, we made it back home. And uh, I was about to do an unboxing for you guys and I realized we made a very big mistake. Um, the rod that I picked up, this uh, Lunkers rod right here. Yeah. Um, I bought a bait casting reel for it and for some reason I didn't check the rod, I just saw it and knew it was the one that I wanted, the design that I wanted. And I got it home and I looked at it and I'm like, wait a second, this is a spinning rod. And uh, so now I'm sitting at home, 30 minutes away from Gander, and I realized that I have a spinning rod to go with my bait caster reel. 
so now I gotta make a trip back and buy the right rod this time. So yeah, I guess we'll see you back at Gander again. Right. <laughs> there we go guys, this is what we need, a casting rod. Seven foot two, it even comes with a little travel bag in there. Well, now that we got the right rod, let's go exchange them and uh, get back on the road. We're back, we got the right rod in here, look at that. So uh, we're gonna go home and hope we have everything we need this time. And then I'll show you guys what I got and talk to you a little bit about our trip coming up. So, see you at home. Oh, all right guys, I'm back home and uh, I got the right rod this time, it's a casting rod. And uh, I'll show you guys what I got. Um, we got this reel here. Right there, Canon, Shimano Canon. It's a nice reel. Uh, I reel left-handed, so I got it in the left-handed version. So it's a 151. Take out a package. And uh, yeah, this is it right here. Show you guys that. It's a pretty sick reel, pretty slick. Uh, it's uh, black and red. It should look good on the rod that I got for it. Um, six three to one gear ratio, so you can use it for like pretty much anything. I think this is gonna be my jigging rod setup. And uh, the rod that I got right here, the Lunkers Defender. Many of you guys know Lunkers TV, the YouTuber. He has his own uh, series rod here, and I bought it. I bought it in a two-piece. Uh, it's easier for travel, and it comes with a traveling case. And uh, I'll open her up, show you guys how she looks. I need a knife. I got my knife. There it is. Here is the rod, folks. Check it out. Check it out. Cool colors, black and white. It's also got red and blue on it. It's a pretty sick rod, not gonna lie. Here it says the defender part. Right there. Favorite. It's pretty sick. It's a two piece, so breaks apart. Easy for travel. <laughs> this I think is the coolest part. It's got a travel bag for it. Isn't that just sick? Got a little zipper. You can zip it, throw it in there, you know, keep her safe. I think that's pretty cool. Well, uh, so today is March 9th, I think, and I don't know what day you guys will see this video, but in 11 days, I think March. Yeah, what's the date that we leave? March what? 20th. Is it 20th? Yeah. I think March 20th is the day we leave to go to Alabama. Well, that's where we're going to end up. But we are the first night we're driving to Illinois, staying in a hotel. Second night we rented a little cottage in Kentucky on Guntersville Lake. Might rent a boat, go bass fishing there. So that's why I bought this rod, this casting reel. And then after two nights at that cottage, we are heading down to Gulf Shores, Alabama. And we've gone there before already. 
we went there two years ago for spring break and it was fun. It was my first time ever saltwater fishing and I went down there with A-Rod again and my family and I just had an absolute blast so we decided to go down there again this year and I got a different rod for that back here. It's another two-piece rod, see? And uh, it's a, just an ugly stick, GX2, seven foot medium power. And I got it paired up with the Luz Mach 2 Speed Spin reel. It's like a $80 reel, I don't know. It's pretty cool. Cool colors, green, I like it. Anyway, that's what I'm gonna use for fishing down in Alabama, because I mean, you always need a spinning rod, they're just clutch. Um, rod bought a spinning reel for there too, but his is at home. And we have two super long rods, I don't even know what they are, like 10, 11 feet for surf fishing. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That trip's coming up in 11 days and uh, we're gonna record it for you guys. So hopefully you guys like it and Hopefully stay tuned on our channel because it's going to be a banger. Hey, if you're new here, see that subscribe bar? Yeah, hit that because, you know, the more people we got here, the better. Am I right? And also turn on the post notifications. Hit that like button. And then uh, leave a comment. Tell me what your favorite fishing gear is to use. I don't care if it's ice fishing, open water fishing. I really don't care. Just hit me up with that. And uh, yeah, I guess we'll see you next time. See ya.